Off we go. Exactly oh. the kind of weekend you were looking for. Yeah, it was good. I mean, we haven't swept anybody in a, quite a while. I know Jerry Syracuse has said it's the first time he's ever swept. So it's it's been a while. We've <laughs> Last year we were on the cusp of doing it home here, I think, three times with big leads that we coughed up. This year, we, this year, today, we finished the job and we just kept adding on runs. We didn't, you know, all those runs later are super important. And, um, you know, we just, again, you go up and down the lineup. Uh, our dudes are being dudes and they're getting big hits. And Jerry and Fritz and Bobby Gallagher with a big hit and run. Ryan Proto, you know, Matt Tobin just continues to have phenomenal ABs. And when it, again, like I said yesterday, when your guys that you count on are guys, then the role guys can kind of settle in and they don't put the pressure on themselves that was necessary. But Nick Dorito gave us a. I was going to say, it really started with the way Dorito yeah. pitched it. Yeah, yeah, it did. It did. He pitched great. You know, he, he gave up a couple moon shots, but I mean, they're solo shots. So, so what? Uh, but the offense responded right away. I just like the way our offense has responded to, you know, when they scored, when we come, they score one, we score three, they score one, we score five. You know, so, um, but, you know, they score one in the ninth, we don't have a chance to hit there. But, you know, Jacob Jetty was good. Uh, you know, a little miscommunication in the outfield should have been out of that with a one, two, three. Uh, and then Zach Rogers, you know, uh, was good. He, that wasn't Rogers in the game too, but the end. That was Michael Symes. Yeah. yeah. Symes gave up the home run. Right. He okay. gave up the home run. Right. But yeah. Symes is yeah. another. Okay. So. Uh, right. But you know, really good weekend. You know, what a difference a week makes. A week ago, we're questioning everything and who we are, and now we're in the exact. We were three and six at this point last year, so we get a chance to go to Albany this weekend. We go to Merrimack Tuesday, play a midweek, and hopefully keep the bats hot and then go to Albany where it's always tough to play and we're gonna face a really good arm on Friday. So we've got our work cut out for us, but it's just nice to enjoy this, you know, on Easter with these, with these guys and, you know, what they've, what they've been through to see them, hear them in the clubhouse, you know, getting after it, singing, doing all their things, being college guys is what makes me the happiest because a week ago and the last couple of weeks have been, been, been hard. And it's, you, know, you feel for them because we put the work in. And right. we knew as soon as something positive happened, and I really think the thing that relaxed everybody was Jerry's double on Friday, and it kind of just took the pressure off a lot of other guys. So, And that's what you guys have to do. You know, that's what those guys have to do. So. Not only Jerry's double on Friday, but Trey's hit yesterday. Trey's hit yesterday, yeah. I mean, no those doubt. were things that the last couple of weeks weren't happening. Hasn't happened all year. And then right. we, we were gifted some freebies, the hit by pitches and walks. We just, nobody had been walking us or hitting us. And the last few days we have. And, you know, that's a really good team over there. They've beaten Virginia right. Tech. They beat Liberty. They swept Davidson. Davidson yeah. So that's a really good team. Now they are hurting a little bit on the mound. You know, one of their guys went down last weekend. Picard is their yeah. guy. And he, he's going to be back. So that's a really good team. And, you know, I understand what it feels like to be on that side, and uh, you know that's a really good coaching staff. And Eric Pelletier is a former assistant of mine, so they'll be fine. They're going to be fine and be a threat in this conference to win the whole thing. So. Does Robert Gallagher have a bullseye on his chest or <laughs> something? I mean, well, I mean, he hadn't been heavy. He was hit by one pitch all year, and last year was whatever. Yeah, thirty. Too, yeah, and now six or seven six. this weekend. So, yeah, I mean, he gets on the plate and. I think the biggest thing with our offense is we're laying, we're not chasing. We're making them put the ball in the zone and we're way more relaxed and in balance. Uh, in the past, when you press, you chase. And they were way more re relaxed with their approach. We had a really good plan this weekend on how we were going to attack their pitchers. And uh, I thought they executed it really well. Good job. All right, thank well you. done. Appreciate it. Good. Thank you.